Welcome back to Stat Wars The Champions. But as you can see, neither of us really deserve to be here because we lost our first game. So it's the losers edition. Um, so yeah, uh, me and Joe trying to salvage some dignity from this whole ordeal. Joe, how are you feeling? Oh, give me. That was the smoothest intro yeah. ever. That was so good, yeah. yeah. I reckon uh, let's do it. Yeah, I could probably just win on that. But yeah, let's uh, hand it away to Kieran Carlin on the questions. Welcome back to Stat Wars. The first question comes from Sonny, who did work experience for us and found all these questions. So they're his questions now, all right? Joe, who is the manager with the most promotions to the Premier League? Oh, Ooh, I think I might know this. There's a few serials. Now I'm thinking potentially Neil Warnock. Warnock's gone up again this season. Yeah. He's a He's very a strong candidate. He's had a lot of promotions, but I don't know if they've all been to the Premier mm. League. Like yeah. taking Sheffield United up, as not he? He's taking a few other teams up. Take I'm also up. thinking Steve Bruce. Bruce, he's done it a mm. few times. Definitely um, nearly did it again this season, didn't he? Holloway has taken a few teams up. Who did he take up? Blackpool? QPR, did he? QPR, maybe. I don't know. I, don't know. I can't remember. Entertaining oh. guy, though. Yeah, entertaining guy. He loves talking about hamster cocks. Yeah. yeah. Never knew that, actually. Um, yeah. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> I will potentially go for, I'll go for Warnock. No! Was it, was it Steve Bruce? Was it Brucey yes, Bonus? Yes, I got that. Brucey Bonus, mate. Yeah, mate. Now, R.I.P. <laughs> T-Fay didn't go up this year, did he? So. No, but the other Bruce did, didn't he? Oh yeah, Bruce did. Forsyth, yeah, yeah, <laughs> true. Up that silver staircase. <laughs> yeah, man, legend. A bit, a bit harsh, isn't it? I yeah. mean, he is dead. Keep dancing. <laughs> Mikey, you are right, mate? Love the hair, keep it going. Can you tell me the first non-European manager to win the Premier League? Ooh! Oh. Jeepers, creepers, Mikhail. Yeah. You love um, your non-Europeans as well, don't I, you? I do, mate, yeah. Japanese girls puke in each other's mouths. Football Mundial, that's yeah. what it's all about. Exactly, Keeping it outside of Europe. Um, I do actually know this. I'm not going to beat around the bush. Um, it's Manuel Pellegrini. Right? Oh, good shout. Yeah. I would probably not have got that. That's a very good shout. Yeah. Joe, who is the youngest ever defender to play for England? England. I don't know why I said it like that. Oh, that's tough. I feel like you've got the wrong end of the stick here. Woof! 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 <laughs> that is so tough. Jeepers, creepers. Who are we thinking here? Maybe an Ashley Cole. Quite young when he broke onto the scene. Rio Ferdinand, a potential mm. candidate also. I'm hoping mm. this is modern era because if, it, if this is like Bobby Moore, oh God, I'm going to be all sorts Moore. of problems. It could be Bobby oh, Moore, you know. It's modern era. Well, well era, done, okay. George, well done. Uh, so I'm thinking Rio Ferdinand here. He'll have a young central defensive candidates. Or also fullbacks. What, Gary Neville? Because he broke, young, broke through quite young. Yeah. Ashley Cole is jumping out at me, standing out at me, big Ash. John Stones. I'm going to stick with Ashley Cole. Oh! Who okay, was it? Quick, quick, quick shout. Micah Richards? Correct. Really? Oh my I god! I actually got that. Yes. Oh I'm on fire god. today. <laughs> I've got every question right. Me, how played, where's Micah Richards well young, now? Though. Rotting in Italy still. Was, yeah, I don't know. Free agent? Really? Jesus. It's a shame, Christ. man. I actually really liked him. He yeah, but good. he was good for a season. He was good for a season. He was really good for a season. And then, and then just went right off the boil. Yeah. Oh well. Poor, poor bit of your drink out for Micah Richards. <laughs> you find the club soon. Mikey, this is to you, not that it matters, because you've absolutely killed this round. You bloody well smashed it, fam. Mad thing, what are you up to? Anyway, I'm gonna ask you, because you still need to win it, because you can't answer Joe's, they don't count, even though it's impressive, to say the least. Can you tell me the oldest Englishman to make his international debut in the last 10 years? Oh, I know Ooh. this. I know this. I think I know this as well. Um, Unless it's a keeper, I'm not sure. Oh, one second. If, have there been any like really old keepers who started? Otherwise, I think it is Kevin Davis, Bolton. Yes. <laughs> no! What is happening? This is going here? so well. I was so not up for this as well. Like, Mikey's I've, like the font I've of all had, knowledge. I've had I've had awful like sleep for the last like four nights and. Um, have you? Yeah, just, just, just haven't had much sleep. So I just was not feeling. Change the diet up. I know, right? Yeah, I, yeah, I probably should. Um, That's why you started going to gym, is it? Yeah, basically. Yeah, I had two <laughs> double cheeseburgers this weekend. It's not good. In fact, I know oh, I had three burgers. Two of them were double cheese ones. So, wow. Yeah, great. Come on, Tomlinson. You need to pull something out of the bag here. Pull a cat out of the bag. Mm. 
Put a Michael McCubbin monkey out of the bag. Look at yes, this mate. number today. Yeah, mate. Sexy. Football Daily debut. I like that. Yeah. I really like it. Is that your spirit animal for the week? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Cheeky yeah. monkey. Don't know. <laughs> Hot patot. Mikey versus Joe. Both United fans, which is f***ing tragic. So here's the United question. Can you tell me the last 10 United transfers that broke their club record? Okay, over to you Tomlinson. Pogba. Uh, Angel Di Maria. Romelu Lukaku. What? What? I broke oh, the record. Oh, broke the record. Um, oh, wow, Rio Ferdinand. Veron. Yeah. Oh, wow, I've got nothing, I'm blanking. <laughs> Patrice Evra. Patrice Evra? Just <laughs> about no seven mil. I have no clue, I'm out. God, Van Nistelrooy was a record. Oh, yeah, we bought him like a year before, didn't we? Not a great start, yeah, I'll be honest. Yeah. This could be over fairly quickly. It's still hot potato, and this time a better question, because it's not about scummy United. Can you tell me all the teams in the Football League, the English Football League, that end in City? Um, Leicester City. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Manchester City. Uh, Stoke City. Yeah. Doing this job for him. <laughs> Exeter City. Yeah. Bristol City. Yeah. Birmingham City. Hull City. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I'm panicking. <laughs> no! How have you done this? I'm out. How have you let this happen? Got nothing. That's it. Just not good enough, is it, for me? Just really not good enough for nah, me. No, mate, you've had, you've had a bit of a mess, to be And you I'm wonder why they never invite me on this show. Yeah. Just, I just don't know about football. It's a general problem. Really disappointed in my own performance today. I'd like to apologise to everybody watching at home. It's just not good enough. Let's move to round three. Kieran, what have you got for me? <laughs> no, Tom Linson. This is absolutely disgraceful yeah, for me. Bad. I haven't got a single f***ing question right, have I? What's happening? What's happening. Who am I? I have played with Podolski, Beckham, and Johan Kabayi. Yeah, goodbye. Ooh, that's obscure ones. Maxwell. Um, Podolski, Bex, and, and Kabayi. It does make me think of PSG for some reason as well, actually. I, don't, I have no idea. I literally have no idea. Uh, yeah, okay, let's move on. For two points, I began my career in League 1 and then moved to the Premier League in 2004. In 2004? I f***ed it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, Laurent Robert. Um, what a name, though. Great to hear the name. Jean Alain Boomsong. Great. That's the only person I can think of, a French player who moved to the Premier League at that 2004? time. 2004? What the f*** was happening? <laughs> For one point, I have a biochemical company. What the shit is that? That could be worth millions. Or billions. It's Matteo Flamini. Yes! Oh my god. Flamini. Finally, some knowledge. Nice it's one, It's worked mate. out for me. 2004? Yeah. Who the f did he join you in 2004? What's he doing now for the business? Is it technology? He wanking over solar panels. What's he doing? <laughs> biochemicals. Where do you learn biochemicals? <laughs> That's a weird Today, thing. mate. That clearly why he's just been underperforming over the yeah, last year. For three points, I have played with Coke, Hazard, Di Maria, and Raul Morelles. Hazard. Ooh. Diego Costa. Mm. Oh. Redemar Falcao. Ooh, that was a good shout. For two points, I have 41 caps for my country. Oh my god, that doesn't help me. <clears throat> That's really unhelpful. Who were the players again? Hazard, Raul Morelles. Oh, Di Maria as well. He was at Liverpool, wasn't he? Did he go to like Fenerbahce? Pepe? <laughs> Okay. This is gonna be oh, yeah, this is a tough one. real outside shout. Javinho. For one point, I won the Champions League with Chelsea in 2012. Professional shit housing that was. Impressive. <sighs> Didier Drogba. Uh, who, who was in that Chelsea team? This is really embarrassing. Ryan Bertrand left wing, Didier Drogba yeah, yeah. top. But this is definitely gonna be wrong, but Jose Vazingua. Is it Carvalho or something? No. Mm. He wasn't there in 2012. What? What? When did he play with Di Maria? Oh, yeah. uh, United, of course. 
I just blanked that out of my memory completely. Yeah, yeah. That's well, so Every stupid. United fan has like permanently blocked with Di Maria Fiasco yeah. from their mind, just letting it, that. It was, yeah, it was oh. a dark time. Bloody hell, that's a good Who Am I? The last Who Am I, and we might have had this one before, I'm not entirely sure, I do not watch this programme. I'm a non-German, I've played with Goethe and Mkhitaryan, but I haven't played for Dortmund. So that would suggest that uh, it would be a uh, Bayern player who's either played for, proposed play for Bayern and United or Arsenal. Ooh, uh, one second. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he's on the hole looking Get for his card. Hello, Michael, one second. Who was that? I'm thinking, I'm thinking who would play with yeah, Mkhitaryan at Shakhtar now, like, but has played for Bayern as well. Oh, that's well God. easy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pass, actually. I can't be asked. It's it's pass to pass. pass. Yeah, you go for it. No, Saka. For two points, I was Bayern Munich's fourth most expensive signing back in 2015. So who's their most expensive is Talisa. Let's yeah. work backwards from there. He cost 40. So I'm looking at the likes of Mats Hummels at around 30. Yeah. Gertz is there as well. Four. Oh, of course. Oh, my thing's gone. My buzz. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, my buzzer, uh, 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 Douglas Costa. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. There we have it. Well, anti climax it ended. I mean, just not good enough all round for me yeah. today. I think you really stepped up today, Mikey. You had yeah, a very good. good round, mate. I was good. I think if I'd played like this in South was the Champions, I might have actually stood a chance. Why didn't but you? I don't know, mate. Just, you know, when you're up against someone from the University Challenge, it just gets, you know, the, in your the pressure just gets to you, yeah. But when you're up uh, against me, it's just easy rides. Easy, Because I don't easy. get a yeah, right, you're, right? you were <laughs> awful. Today, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, you made it very easy for me, so thank you. But uh, yeah, that's it, isn't it? Yeah, I'm the I'm the best loser apparently. Um, I don't think that gives me uh, a route into the quarterfinals, unfortunately. So it doesn't really mean anything. Just totally but, pointless, this was. Yeah, it? absolutely pointless. But I hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> it. Um, let us know what you think. Put in your questions for next week below, and then um, then yeah, Joe, where should they go next? Find Mikey on Capital FM yeah. <laughs> from 10 till 6 weekdays. Um, yeah, come over to Football Daily. This goes out on a Saturday, which means the top yeah. 10 will have gone out today. I don't know what the title is. You'll have to find out yourself. Sweet. <laughs> Bye. See you in a That oh, hair is really protruding today. It is, man. Yeah, yeah bro. Where is it's like is. dipping down. It's because when I put the mic on, it kind of yeah, just gives a little bit of I like of it, mate. Just tease them. Just tease. <laughs> tease. <laughs> tease them in. Yeah, mate. Jalap's I've, got I've, the same one in back. Yeah, yeah, fuck the back shit. Like I've got, I've got, but I've got shoulder hair, so it like comes up here. And like before, I thought it was really. I used to hate it. I was quite self-conscious about it. But actually, when I've seen it recently, it kind of comes up in like an X. And I've, I've grown to embrace it. Professor X. Yeah. Professor. X. It looks pretty. It looks pretty good. <laughs>